this wonderful machine and with the help of this machine we are going to make one more awesome VIP UFO whatever name you want you can give it yourself so what we're gonna do is we're gonna obliterate it completely whatever is left and we will remove everything and then we'll make a new unique thing with it which we can call UFO or VIP car Tell me what name to give. UFO car. So UFO car it is. And I'm sure that you guys might never have seen anything like it. So shall we start? No, you step aside. Huh? This one we will do it. Yes. Yeah, we will start it. Not start, we will do the meaning, whole thing. Meaning, meaning, meaning what? This time we will make it. You make it all the time. We will make the whole thing. Will you be able to? Yeah. We will make it, right? Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. So this time you guys do this, okay? Yeah. Yeah. What? My eyes are on you. Okay. So that instead of making a UFO car, you don't end up making a banana car. Or else instead of making a UFO car, you make an underground car. Or an underwater car. I need a UFO car. Okay. And it should be in the level of the Titanium Army. Okay, done. Okay, okay, you guys start then. Start with the shouting. Yeah! yeah! <coughs> and ask everyone to subscribe also. Subscribe to the channel. Yeah, subscribe! Okay guys, now let's make it. Not make it, we'll break it! Yeah! Oh, no, wait, wait, wait! Guys, we don't have to break it this way. No, no, no! Stop, stop, stop! Nobody's going to listen, they're gonna break it. Guys, we have removed the battery. Now we are going to remove the controller and the motor. So, guys, from beneath, our e-rickshaw looks like this. Okay, open it up, Ballu. Guys, look at its condition. Guys, we have broken down the rickshaw. Now let us give it a new shape. Yeah, Chaman bro, would you like to say something to the Titanium Army? Whatever happens, Chaman is going to make it today. What? And guys, we have been making this for four days. Tell them what you're making. We are making a vehicle. No, no, tell the name. What is it? It was an e-rickshaw before. But what are we making? Yeah, shall I start? So guys, our frame is almost completed. And now, uh... Top structure is... <laughs> we are making the top structure. So guys, the metallic frame is ready and now we are gonna make it interior. Right? Interior. Interior. So guys, the UFO's interior is complete. Now we'll make the body. One, two, three. It's ready, guys! After three months of hard work, our UFO car is finally ready. 
And now the time has come to call Big Bro. So guys, now we are going to take a look at our UFO car. I don't know why they called us over there. That too so far away. Maybe it's because it's uh, ground clearance is very low, or maybe any other reason. There they are. There they are. So they are planning a surprise for us. So let's go and see what it is. They are here. They are here. They are here. Yay! Yay! Woo! Yay! Woo Wow! Wow, boys! Wow! Wow! You guys did a good job. Let me give you a pat on your back. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> guys, frankly speaking, it looks very nice. And by the way, the UFO I thought about it was something like this only. Believe me, guys, I have some idea. But I am gonna see this UFO car for the first time with you guys. But you might have seen it while they were making it. So at the count of three. One, One two, two, three. three. Wow guys the boys have done a very good job and deserves a like guys it looks absolutely gorgeous and guys steering sitting arrangement doors where are they it doesn't have a steering nor does it have a handle then what is this how are we supposed to ride this and i was right about one thing the ground clearance is very less and maybe that's why they called us here oh it's very low oh it's futuristic huh you guys enjoy the b roll and afterwards i will dry this and show you okay just tell me what the system huh and then we will see how it runs Chaman bro open the gate. Oh! Wow! <laughs> so guys, this is how we get inside this and now let me show you from inside. Wow! Keep holding it. Don't drop it on me. So there's a fan here and one over here. What is this? Accelerator. This is the accelerator guys. Brake. Brake. Where is the steering? Doesn't have one. Then how will we drive this? With the two skulls. Oh, these two skulls. So guys, this has a lever system using which we will drive it. And as you can see it's so great looking from inside it's as good looking from inside as from outside and one thing is that guys we get a 360 degree view from inside as you can see there are no metals or doors or any other distractions you can see all the sides this side that side all the sides now let me go inside and then i'll see what the feel is from inside so guys now we are inside the ufo car and from inside it looks like this close it close it wow nice So guys nothing is visible from outside but everything is visible from inside you can see all the four sides from here they must be thinking that i can't see them but actually i can see them from inside you can see all four sides and above as well now i'll tell you the functions there are two fans here one two there's a lever over here and another over here there's a cut off switch here it's an mcb and this is for moving forward or backwards and with that we have two buttons over here and if i switch this on the lights will come on look it's for night use it will look really good at night it's all around the car and it looks so beautiful and if i switch this on the fans will turn on wow <laughs> there could be a greenhouse effect inside it could get warm and hence the fans and now let's do one thing let's start this to start do i press the mcb or what yeah okay guys now it has started and now i'm going to leave the brake and press the accelerator oh <laughs> step aside step aside so guys here goes okay 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 now we are moving okay okay yeah 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 And guys you can see how smoothly this is moving I hope nothing comes in front of us that's all <laughs> Wow the brakes are a little tight I'm holding the phone with one hand and that's causing a little problem so let's put the phone down and then drive Oh guys it's quite a different feeling in here and it's fast too So 
I have driven quite a distance now. It was really nice. This is a very different feeling. You can see all the sides and the controls are excellent. Now let's put it in reverse. Reverse might be difficult. So now we have put it in reverse and as soon as I press the accelerator, the car will move backwards. Oh! Whoa! And the brakes and now let's move forward. Cameraman stand aside, stand aside. Now let's move forward. Guys, look. Look at the view from all the sides. I can see all around me. And I am sitting in a UFO car right now. <laughs> now let's go fast and furious. Guys, it feels like I'm flying a spaceship, really. Especially because there are joysticks instead of steering. I'm telling you the truth, guys. This is an awesome feeling. And I can see everything from here clearly. The guys have done a good job with the view of the cockpit. You can see all the sides clearly. Nice. <laughs> Guys, this is a Ferrari. So I tried to do a drift and this did a good job. But tell me it only has one tire in the back. Yeah. <laughs> so ground clearance was a little low and I almost ran over half of our team. <laughs> so I felt really nice inside this spaceship flying it. The boys did a wonderful job. This is the first time I did not help them. Everything they did by themselves. So like the video for their efforts. See the look and the design. This is a first class job. Awesome. Oh, Manish is inside. Here he goes. Bye bye UFO car. So guys, I hope you like this video. A weird and unique concept. We always try to do something like this. Something new and unique. Oh, I hope he doesn't go and bang into them. Kill himself. So I'll see you in the next video with a new topic. Until then, Jai Hind, Jai Bharat. Love you all.